it's time we venture into uncharted territory. We are finally getting to the point in the playthrough series where we're advancing to stuff that I haven't seen yet in Small Land, and I'm pretty excited about it. So we're back here at Scotty. We're going to turn in the Rhino Beetle Horn that we got from killing the Rhino Beetle because he sent us down there to do the quest in the first place. We're going to let him know that we killed it. He's going to update our map, and he's going to teach us how to tame geckos. And there it is right there, the gecko tree. So what he's going to mark on our map is the location of Lizette. Or no, I'm sorry, Lysandra. Lysandra. Now, Lysandra is likely the area where spiders are at and filled with all types of other horribleness and where we're going to need to get silk to make the loom. Before we do that, we're going to go play with the gecko a little bit and, and tame one of those guys. So we're going to make up the gecko treat and head back down to the beach. And we'll try to ride over to Lysandra in style. But it's now all new and uncharted territory. I'm pretty excited. I've got a little outpost set down over here just, uh, just in case I die so I don't have to go too terribly far back. I've got a cauldron down. Uh, I need a couple of things to make the gecko treat, and that is a, a ant, two ant heads, two bee heads, a petal, and seed oil. All things considering, it's really not that difficult to, to make. All that stuff is kind of close around here. Uh, the only thing that's annoying is the seed oil because I would need to make a, and I didn't bring the stuff for this from the base, I would need to make a uh, stone cutter. So I may make a trip back to the base just to grab the stuff and, and craft the gecko treat up there. And then we'll uh, we'll go back to the beach. You know what? That's exactly what I'm doing. We're going to head up there and then we'll go back to the beach and tame the gecko. We tried to escape the beaches, but Small Land just said, no, too bad. You're coming back here. You live here. But we're back at our area that we've called home for so, so long. And we're going to tame ourselves a quick gecko and use it as our means of transportation. Now, a little bit of spoiler alert. I know what kind of happens with the gecko. We're just going to quick smash. I'm not going to... Oh, thanks. Bite the bug. Okay, we're going to yoink him. We got him. We're on him. And now we're going to get off of him because he should attack this guy for me. Yeah, there he goes. We've tamed him. He's going to help me in combat now, which is the best part about the gecko, I think. He's, he dies easy. So warning, spoiler alert, he can die pretty easy. Uh, but the grasshopper is a better mount. Like the gecko's not very quick. And this is him like sp sprinting. He's just, he's just not quick. But if you get into combat with something, you can dismount and he'll aid you in combat, which is pretty cool, but he's not tanky. He's not tanky at all. So I, my opinion on this is that I actually prefer the grasshopper because I just want to get places fast that I, I want to run, right? I'm not going to like sit here and try to fight everything with my with my lizard pal. Another thing, and the reason why I kind of came up here is another thing is you would think that the gecko could like climb up stuff. Oh, please don't die. Okay, cool. He didn't die. I don't think he takes fall damage, actually. I, he can't. Like the gecko can't really like climb up stuff either. So he's just kind of like a, a busted... A busted mount. I hope they do something with that. That's the reason why I like call that out and highlight it. Oh no. Yeah, this has been driving me nuts. This has been happening lately in the game. Uh, this like fatal error and it's been driving me absolutely bonkers. I don't know if you guys are experiencing this or having any trouble with this, but it's like it's, it's even making my recording like stutter at the moment. It's just super frustrating. Hopefully they get a fix to this too. Well, it rolled us back here to our little outpost in front of Scotty. Not a, like, not terrible. It gave us our, our gecko tree back, so it's, it's pretty much like our, um, <laughs> our gecko testing, taming, it never really happened. So we gotta, we gotta refund on the treat. If we, um, if we encounter another gecko, we'll use it and, I guess, like, have him battle alongside of us as we venture into spider territory. But this is what we're doing. We're venturing in the spider territory. I've never gone further west than that little garden nozzle here. So we're going to start to get into like this general area and hopefully we get some new materials and things to craft with. Uh, one of the things that I think we're likely going to encounter is something called a garlic leaf. Now, the garlic leaf is what you need to build. Oh, that's a, a wasp to build this. The bigger tier. Oh, that's a wasp ah. to build a bigger tier chest. He's on to me. Should I battle you with the sword? 
Ooh, okay. Let's let's try. Let's I battled the last bee with the sword and it ended up being like kind of okay. Oh, where's my stam? Where's my stam at? Where you at, stamina? All right, so we'll just send it. We're not doing very good at the job. Oh, we got poison stuff. I must have looted a poison related item. Aha, the poison gland. There we go. So we learned how to make a poison mace I saw, poison darts. That's kind of cool. We'll have to mess with the crafting bench a little bit later when it's not so nighttime outside. It's always freaking night. But I might want to farm those wasps, I guess, if the if the poison glands are dropping off of them and we need it for something fancy. Oh, man. I mean, if spiders are going to live anywhere, it's... I hear it. I hear them. I heard something. If spiders are going to live anywhere, it's going to be here. This looks just creepy. I'm waiting for webs to kind of like pop out of the ground or like connect the dead brambles of whatever that is. Oh, I think I think I see some too off of the distance. I don't, I don't want to go. In. Do I have to go? I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Uh, there's a beetle bro over here. We need to go further north still, I think. I'm going to check my map as soon as Beetle's not kicking my ass. Uh, ask her. I'll just... Figure out. Yeah, we still need to go further north. We could go right through this. Oh, God, I hope... Oh, shit, it is one! Oh, my God, there's two! Oh, okay, okay, that... Oh, they're kicking my ass! I can't, like, I can't dodge! Oh, my God, I just got murdered! What? What? I mean, we call that from a mile away. Like, we knew, we knew this was going to happen. And it still scared the crap out of me. Uh, maybe we can go in without getting, like, tagged on by a freaking beetle. That would be slightly useful. Let's see, we are just near our gravestone. That means two spooters are going to come out of the freaking woodwork. Let me see if I can just divide and conquer. There's my candles. I didn't even see. Here, let's try. Let's try bug vision, bug senses. Let's see him. I hope they're weak to slash. I was just rocking the sword, and then for I think they poisoned me because I couldn't dodge. I was just doing that weird like step. Let, let, let's be sneaky, lads. Oh, did they come out of the hole? Oh, we're not sneaky. <laughs> A nocturnal spider. Okay, uh, we're dodging away. I think he's stronger because it's nighttime too. God, Scooter, I hate you. Please. Oh, for God's sake. Chitin axe, chitin spear. I'm still taken down. Uh, let me get my body. I got band aids on there. I got a freaking. Oh, please, 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 please. It's getting dark. It's getting real dark. Oh my God, I had like two health left. Oh, holy crap. I am in pain. I am in Spain. Oh my lord. Okay, let's get away from that situation. Titan axe, I saw. Kite no, 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 no. I don't have time for you, Beetle Bailey. I'm just gonna hit him with a sword. I don't wanna switch to my Oh he's weak to or he's strong to sword. Let's know what they add. Or the hammer. Or whatever weapon smashes bugs most efficiently. There. Ah, oh, it's a danger zone out here. I don't want to burn my potions. I'm going to have to. It's Please, sun, arise. Arise. How am I doing? Uh, so I got a spooter head. Exotic recipes. Mm-hmm. All right. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. It's horrifying. I got a poison gland. Oh, a two poison glands. So we got a poison gland off the spooter. A spooter eye and silk. That was what the achievement was for, I think, was getting silk. So you need to unfortunately farm more of these guys. And it looked like they were weak against the uh, the slashing of my sword. Let's just be super careful. Are these eddy shrooms or poison shrooms? Eddy shrooms. Okay, cool. 
I don't think I need any of those just right now at the moment, but oh, I see one. <gasps> I see two. Oh, horrifying. I hate that. Oh, I hear him. Where is he? Oh my god, they're everywhere. They're just everywhere. I, I'm in the nest. I am in the nest. Oh, there's three over here. There's no way I can battle three. One almost murdered me. Two definitely murdered. Two definitely murdered me. Let's see. What are you? Can I can I pick you out? A wolf spider, nocturnal and wolf. Um, edge damage is what he's uh, weak against. There's a Nocti right over here. Let's go after the wolf. Maybe he's slightly easier. He said optimistically. God, I hate this so much. Oh, God, I hate him. Okay, we're dodging. We're slashing. We're dodging. We're slashing. Uh, did it say I could tame him? Absolutely the hell not. It did say I could tame the wolf spider. I don't want to do that. We're going to have to for science, but I don't want to do that. I hate spiders. Okay, if you're wondering why I'm freaking, if this is your first Nerd Break video and you're wondering, or you've never watched Nerd Break before, in every game, there's always spiders. Like, there's always spiders, usually of the giant variety, and I hate spiders. Like, I hate spiders. So hopefully that gives you some context on why I am going through this at like 0 0.5 insect miles per hour because I'm just not I'm, I'm just not having it. I don't know. I don't even know what what was I doing? I'm supposed to meet Lizette. I'm just like or Lizandra, whatever her name is. I just I don't want to go deeper. Uh, is there a great tree around here or something? I'm going to have to move my base. Ooh, all right, it's starting to it's starting to day up. My torch is getting a little bit. Oh, let's keep it out. We'll just have to full repair it. It's too dark. Yeah, those are definitely the red caps are definitely poison mushies. Uh, here we go. Here's a way down. That's not going to cause me fall damage. I was hoping the uh, the beetle armor slash chitin armor would be a, a touch more sturdy against these guys, but apparently not. There's going to be another tear. I wonder if I get spider armor. I know there's it's like spoiler alert. I know there's bee armor. Well, Lysandra is an NPC and all, like, oh, I'm going the wrong way. And like all NPCs craft armor, he said optimistically. Drostana does craft bee armor, but uh, we need, like, the sp the silk and stuff before we can craft that, so we have to come here. We can't, like, skip to bee armor. Bee armor does cool stuff. I don't want to necessarily spoil it, but you, you may have already known, so bee armor gives you wings. Unlike Red Bull, it, it actually gives you wings, and you can do fun stuff with that. Uh, I feel like the wolf spiders weren't as poisonous as the nocturnal spiders, which probably tracks considering the stuff is more dangerous at night. What is that? Black Widow? Are there just 17 different types of spiders down here? You look, you look different, unless you're a nocturnal. Oh, please, I don't want to get close enough to like... Yeah, that's Black Widow. It is, it's a Black Widow. Holy crap, edge damage is what you're weak against. Do we send it? Are you a, like a mini boss or something? Oh, I got a potion. Let's let's hate myself and send it. Oh, I didn't I didn't sneak. Oh, you're not that bad. Uh, I have no stamina. Oh, I'm in a corner. You know the most like most dangerous spider known the most venomous spider known what of known to man, and they weren't they weren't that awful. I am still ticking down though. This poison has got to stop. Uh, band aid. Please band-aid, save my life. Uh, need flint shears or better. Ooh, did I ever... Did I make the shears? I don't think I made shears. Looks like we're coming back to these. We are coming back. Uh, I need to... <laughs> I'm just getting so distracted. I have to completely turn around. North, west is the direction we need to consistently go. We'll just casually slay these horrifying beasts. 
along the way. We'll come back for spider cuckoos. Maybe it's just a way to harvest silk without murdering spoods. Although I can't thin the population of these guys enough. Like, let's just, just get rid of them all together. Cheers. Yeah, cheers. Spider cocoon. All right, we've got ourselves set up into, into a predicament here. Let's see if we can't parkour up. Torch. Oh. If you go, I'm in trouble. And of course, it's got to be like ominous and rainy and like nasty. This game is really, really dark. Uh, a lot of the time, and I don't think there's really a way to, like, adjust the brightness. Like, when I was starting to record and starting to stream this, I was like, oh, wow, this is kind of, like, ominously dark and probably difficult to watch, right? Oh, is this her? Is this her? Oh, God, he's behind me. Uh, I, I, I might have to ocean if he poisons. Yeah, he poisons. Let's slurp it. Kick in, kick in. It takes a while to kick in. There it goes. Yeah, all the, all the spiders poison. All the spiders poison. But anyways, I was saying like it, it's it's almost like difficult. It's difficult for me to see. So for you guys watching, it's got to be like, oh, what the hell is that? It's gonna be difficult to watch if it's super dark. There is a bullfrog. There is all kinds of horribleness over here. Candles, I feel like, are a sign of safety. No, maybe not. Like let's let's follow the candles. Let's especially since our torch is about to die. Let's stick to the candles. Maybe it's giving away my position. Maybe it's leading me to my untimely demise. Maybe it's oh, water. Maybe it's leading me into my freaking yeah untimely demise. It's gonna drown me. Let's check this. This might be a mob plant, or maybe it's a garlic. That's a mob. Or it's a sapling actually. Let's get some. Let's get some stuff. I don't have much in the way of like creating outposty stuff. Uh, putting down a bed would be relatively smart at this stage in the game. Whose backyard has wind chimes made out of bones? I have more questions now. Much more questions. I'm assuming this is a backyard because there was a picnic table on the other side. Maybe it's a like a like a national park resort or something. But somebody made like this is the Blair Witch Project over here. That's a really old reference. If you don't get it, I'm sorry. I just dated myself. We're close. We're so close. Just follow the candles to safety. And we'll put down a bed up here. Oh, we gotta battle our way though, it looks like. Don't see me, 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 don't see me. I don't think it's on me. Hey, wow. I just had to channel those good vibes. Just channeling those good vibes. Those anti spooter vibes. Let me uh, eat so that I'm casually regenerating. I miss my lizard foxtail. I think this is new, right? No, wait. Foxtail is new. We saw this on the beach. This is not new. But we'll get some anyway. That is a stone. All right. We're just going to call you Liz. Liz, I think this has got to be... I mean, this is horrifying. This has got to be your home, right? I'm oh yep there's a dude in there Liz is one with the spiders I was gonna jump down there I was like oh, I'll probably take fall damage but there's a spider down there so now we're not definitely not gonna do that go around let's just pull this out till it breaks it's too, it's too dark it's too dark. It's too ominous. Oh, there's a spider over there. It's gonna snap like any second too. I can't parkour that. Ooh! I'm gonna battle one more time. Black Widow. Do I have? I have Band Aid. Let me pre Band Aid. My sword. I really don't think that it is safe to do this with anything less than the chitin armor. It has the, like, it doesn't do great against the poison. That's kind of what's trucking me, but it does have the highest defense stat. 
that is currently available to us. I need blank for Oh, I, I didn't look to see if there was poison. Oh, shit, snaps. I didn't look to see if there was poison resist, um... Uh... Stuff on the alchemy bench. There goes Firefly Torch. Oh, please don't do that. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Please don't. Please, please. Can I? Anything. Is there anything I can do? I use my potion. Uh, okay. Just, it's like slightly out healing it. Please, Liz. <gasps> poison can't actually kill me. We found that out. The... <laughs> So poison can't ever murder you. You just will keep you at one health forever. I am in so much trouble. Ball damage will kill me. Uh, a dry wind will kill me. Uh, just a gentle breeze. Liz, where are you? Poison's not wearing off. I don't understand. There's a spider down there. Do I have to like out heal the poison? All right, let's let's we've pushed our luck. What do I need for this? One one singular wood, and it's so dark. Uh, be something close. Here, let me bug vision. Oh, I'm trying to build. Can't bug visual I'm trying to build. I don't oh, there's a spider over there. We that's what we want to avoid. Where's my pick? Let's put my pick up and we'll just tap this bark. Okay, we should have gotten what perfect. We got one wood from that. Let's run. so much scare right now. The building is not allowed here. All right, how about over here? Here, okay, there we go. Uh, a singular campfire would require two wood. I think we can do that. Oh my God, the poison's worn off, finally. If he sees me, I'm dead. I'm just, there's no coming back. Uh, oh, did I set my spot? I didn't set my spot. If you were yelling at me, bro, you put down the bed, but you didn't set spot point. What are you doing? I heard you. I, I swear I heard you. There we go. Respawn point has been set. We we can now safely die. To this very spider right here. As I try to get wood for a campfire. To provide us with just the slightest bit of light. This is so freaking nerve-wracking. I'm not, I'm not close enough. There it goes. Okay. I think all I needed was the one wood. Oof. My heart rate. I hear it in game and in real life. No, it was two wood. Oh, this is just unfortunate on so many angles. All right, we're going, we're sending. It's lightness down here. Lightness and brightness. There was a spider. Liz, I don't, I already don't like you. I just need you to be aware of that. All right, there's two of those dudes. They look like they're smaller, though. But this is just the worst. Please, tummy. Regenerate and heal me. I ran out of band-aids. I don't see you, Liz. Oh, I have probably gone down too far and made a big, 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 big mistake. Oh, Liz. You are just the creepiest. Did they follow me? Are they pursuing me into your 
the safety of this place. The giants. Huge humanoid creatures used to roam the overworld long ago. They were known among small folk as giants. Nobody knows the reason why they disappeared, but since their time has ended, the small folk have cautiously started to come out of the burrows and explore the overland. Oh, that's not super ominous or anything. Just like Liz's lair. If there was ever a tiny witch, it's her. 100%. 